it gets a bit more interesting if you open up two VRXs in SDR Uno. As you can see in the top half of the screen, we're looking at uh, 40 meters, and the RSIN 1 button is checked, showing that whatever we tune to in this upper window will be reflected by the rig. So for example, uh, I'm not sure what's going on here, but we could tune down here and see what's going on down there. And you see that the rig has followed us down to 7.03. Now since SDR Uno is capable of displaying 10 megahertz of spectrum, we've taken advantage of this in the second VRX, and we're looking all the way through the 20 meter, 30 meter, and 40 meter bands all at the same time. So we're looking at a fairly broad sweep of the spectrum to see what may be of interest that we may want to listen to. Now we don't necessarily have to tune the rig to check out what's going on there. So for example, if we wanted to move up to the 20 meter band, uh, we, could, we could click somewhere in the 20 meter band in the spectrum. Uh, we can zoom in on that part of the spectrum, as you see here. And uh, there's a signal we can see right here. And we can just unmute SDR Uno and hear what's going on. If it's something that we want to listen to on our rig, we then have the option of going to RSYN 1 and assigning the Omni rig controls to this VRX. So if we click on that, all of a sudden we find the rig has moved to 14.15 MHz. You can in fact open up multiple VRXs, up to 16. For example, you could have individual VRXs, one for 20 meters, one for 30 meters, one for 40 meters. In fact, any band you like, as long as they fall within the uh, 10 megahertz sampling range of the RSP. In this case, by setting the LO at 11.175, it was just an arbitrary number, I can record anywhere from uh, 5 megahertz below that, so 6.17, all the way up to 5 megahertz above that, so 16.17. So I hope you get the idea of what you can do here. It's very flexible, and uh, you can easily switch back and forth from one VRX to the other just by clicking the RSYN1 button in the corresponding RX control.